É. Chega até a ser exagero, não precisa disso aí. Berbers! Guys, we have now Berbers vs. Camir from Mr. Yo. So, Camir have good scorpions, he can rush us with monks, scorpions, pikemen, but we have the Berbers, which means that I can pretty much try to go for camel archers, that are a good choice. But the camel archers also suffer a bit with the scorpions, so I'm not sure if I'm trying to play with knights or camel archers in this matchup. I have to see how the game develops to have an answer to that. But for now, let's find the resources, let's focus on the, on the early game. Later I decide about what unit I'm going to use. I don't have to decide it right now. There are two ships here, another two on the back. It's so a follow! I'm just going to send a scout there to get those ships. I already have six views on the ship. The deers are there. Camir are probably one of the best sieves for this map. It's a different style from the Meso sieves like the Aztec, but the idea is you can go truly fast to Castle Age with Knights and Siege, or just boom with like 30 minutes uh, Castle Age dropping to sieves and later switch to elephants or other uh, strong weapons like them. So that's basically the Camir gameplay. That's basically what Mr. Yo might try to exploit. And honestly, the scorpions of the Camir are it's very a new sub, annoying man. to deal with. Thanks to dude before Ooh. he regretted. Thanks for the sub, man. Thank you a lot for the sub. Bring back the view. Oh, I'm gonna I'm going to get eye though. Already starting to make some houses. Oh, the middle is very close to me. Huh? It's a follow! Click and click back for the guy who asked it. I get a view, click the building, click back, and that's how I drop back the resources, man. Okay, oh my god, this map is good for walling, huh? How easy is this to wall? Looks very easy. Going for the other boar. Oh, come on. I like guys to wall very quickly because if the enemy comes for a rush. I will be already walled. Yo is here. He might try to kill my view. No. I'll try to pick a fight with his scout. Try to pick up a fight. Go there, go there, view. Damn it. Good. I'm fighting, but I'm using a view here. Okay. I have way more HP than Mr. Yu. I will be able to force him back to his town center. He just gave me away his position. Uh, I'm not gonna to invest so much over there. Oh, there's some deers here. That's a good info. 
I know that his deers are around, so if I just stay here, I can deny him from taking the deers. Not that he need as the Khmer, but well, still a valuable asset. Huh? It's a follow! I decided, guys, I will try to go for the camel archers because uh, if I can use them correctly, I can kill a lot of views, I can use them for raiding. Let's scout a bit more. I'm fully walled. It's a follow! Going for the stone. We need some farm as well. At this point, he can be already on his way to feudal. Oh, he's walling, yeah? He's fully walled already. Uh oh. I just realized that if he's fully walled, he might already be on his way to the feudal age. So I have to get my scout out of here or else he can go up and probably get a kill. Going back. Going for the gold. So... That's it. So guys, I'm eating here uh, the deers. I have plenty of views collecting food. 15 to be honest, to be more specifically. To be honest, what the fuck? And sometimes I don't know what I'm saying. Man. Like most of the times. I have three views collecting stone. Those views will allow me later to be able to make the camo archers. Uh, they will just be the, the views that will allow me to drop a castle. Since you walled earlier, I expect him to reach castle age earlier than I. But he's not on feudal age yet. Anyway, he doesn't need to make any building, so he can just go to feudal and immediately click to castle age. I can get some information about how many units he has or how many resources he has. Right now I know that he has 29 views, the same resources that I do, because he's, we are probably doing similar uh, times. He's now on feudal age and he's going up with population 29. That's a very high population for Khmer. So I'll be honest, I don't know why he has such a high population. I'm going to reinforce my walls. Going for the stone, making some upgrades, finishing the deer, going back to the TC. So I don't know why Mr. Yo has that amount of views as Khmer. Makes no sense to me. We will ask him later or we are going to find out. I'm honestly thinking that he might be trying to go for a, a build order to already drop elephants and siege or some crazy stuff, you know. I'm thinking a lot of things here. Let me get my view to see if he's around with the scout. Yep, there's the view and the stable. So he'll try to come for knights here. He just gave us the information, I was right about it. So I just have to reinforce these walls for now. Let me prepare a few more farms. He'll probably try to drop some siege here, guys. We are reinforcing it, he's attacking us. He's dropping the siege. I'm buying time here with my scout. Making a castle. 
He's killing this with an elephant. Here, have the night. We are making the castle there. Let's send more viewers to make it. I should already send some viewers to the gold. Wood upgrade. Gold upgrade. He has one elephant and he'll have siege. We are just going for the camel archers. I'm gonna make a gate here. Good. Now that we have the castle, it, we are much more safe to work. Is this a mango now? He has a mango now. Uh, let me walk here and make a stone wall behind. For now, guys, I'm just making a few camo archers and I'm walling behind and buying time. What I'm trying to do here is to buy time, nothing else. Until I have enough cam uh, camo archers to defend myself. So I guess we read his game correctly, we defended so far. I have no fletching. I have not I have no upgrades yet for my units. I don't think it works to make a a monk already because he only has one elephant. It would be too predictable and a too high investment for it. The mango is coming here. Dropping a second TC. He'll start to harassing this wall with the mango now. Oh no. He will not. We micro. And escape. And that's it. Okay, so the first uh, phase of the game we defended, now it's time to counter raid. I will try to wall this back to get this map for me. Making yet another to see the bull. My god, look how much arrows I need to kill an elephant. Huh? And the camo archers are a pretty strong unit. Let me check if it has something out there. We defended from the push, but now we have to catch him on the booming because his Zico guys must be already growing faster than ours. Or not, because he has a lot of scorpions. Eh? Look the amount of scorpions he has. Okay, he has monks and a TC. Fighting the scorpion seems like a bad idea. I'll try to raid his base. He's controlling the middle, which is bad. Losing my scout. Hmm. He's also controlling the map with monks and scorpions, so I'm not feeling comfortable at all. Try to kill some views. Kill the view! What a fucker. I just dropped this scout here because if I see a monk, I might try to kill it. Oh, trying to kill Vils and failing in the process. Scorpions, let's go out. 
Let's go back to this stone. Drop stables. Drop a barracks first. Huh? We don't even have a barracks. A new lumber camp here might be needed. I will walk with this split formation because a few shots from those scorpions can be deadly to my army. He stopped collecting this wood. Interesting. I'm trying to call some idle time to him, but it's not an easy thing to do. I'll leave a camel here. Uh oh, the scorpions are there. Ha! The scout nearly killed the monk. Guys, look at this. He has something inside of that siege workshop. Maybe, maybe, maybe he's planning to go for elephants and runs and try to kill my castle. Like doing a very strong push. Maybe he's thinking on that, huh? I know that his scorpions are on the other side, so I'll try to use this time to annoy him. Uh oh, the scorpions are here. Yeah, he's, there's definitely something here. Let's drop some more stables. Uh oh, scorpion. Blow lines, light calf. Trying to get more views. Oh, good. Man, one camel here can delay him so much. Imagine two. I'm trying to make light calves now. I'm gonna drop a lot of new farms. I'll need more houses to support that. Also dropping the houses. He'll have to get wood in other places like here. Oh, he's making a forward castle. I was not counting on that. Shit. Yeah, he's gonna make this for castle. No time for me to stop it. Let's go away before I die to all these scorpions. This is bad. He has a castle that he can use to siege me. He's now on pure age. Oh no. Not one more. Well, I'll have to make a uh, make some siege myself. That's still blocked. He's trying to get wood here. He's gonna get my castle, that's for sure. Uh, what I can do here? Uh oh. What? Just regular monks, okay. I can try to do a lot of those guys. More of these. A castle here on the other side. Come on, really? Oh my god, I will get housed badly here because I will lose the castle. 
This will be so bad for me. So I'm trying to hurry up to make more. I'm doing my best to stop his houses here. Fuck, he just got my university on the making. It's now. I have to stop his scorpions somehow. <laughs> Trying to stop his castle. Oh my god, stop the castle! Stop the fucking castle! Stop the fucking castle! We are killing a lot of things here. But we are also losing the camo archers. I have to keep putting pressure now with those light caps. Finish this run. Go to this gold. I try my best to kill more scorpions. Killing the traps, killing the siege, the castle age approach is working. Good, he's trying to make stables to make elephants in the middle. I'm just gonna keep sending uh, light calves to the middle and he won't be able to ever leave the TC. Let's siege the middle. I need a market to sell food and go there. I'm now going for the gold. I'm even going to drop now a uh, castle here. Man, this is great. This guy is so much trouble now. He's not finding an easy answer to that. He wants to, but there is no easy answer. He's trying to go for the elephant, but he lost way too much eco. <laughs> Let's keep making the runs. I'm about to take away his gold and he'll have no weapon to defend himself. I'm restarting to make ammo archers. Upgrading the gold. Losing a few army to his elephants, but now he's about to lose all the views. There we go, losing views, congrats. Let's get his relics. I have way too much light calves for him to deal with. He must be pissed, man. Have you ever lost a game to fucking light calves? <laughs> Gonna make a few more camo archers. I'm cleaning this out. He has no gold. Now he has the issue of having no gold, man. Hard one, huh? Only these relics that are soon going to die. Let's move. Oh, look, look at this, huh? Elephants. Castaway elephants. They're good, but can they kill an army? Which like five times their size? They can't. He's good. But he cannot win the fight because of the numbers. I'm about to click up. I'll keep making those guys and I get that to get this game is over, guys. I don't see much hope for Mr. Yo. But I have to keep pressuring. I'm not allowing him to do anything. Let's go there. What he has? Cavaliers! Oh my god, there is hope. He has a lot of cavaliers. Let's try to raid him. And let's make a transition to camels. Like, why not? I have the resources, so... Uh-oh. 
He's not allowing me to raid him. I'm picking up some scorpions. He's trying his best to go for the cavaliers. He's trying to make a lot of eco. He killing, he's killing easily my army. But I can just make the transition to cannons, as I said. Let's try to raid him on the other side. Making the camels, dropping a new castle and some new stables. All obviously upgraded. Good. Let's keep making the camels. Woohoohoohoo, Mr. Yo! How are you going to deal with the camels? Let's steal his relics. Good, good man. I'm being able to raid him. Look at this. I'm raiding him good. Uh oh, he's getting my, my views there, but I have like 30 camels already, man. I don't even need the upgrades with this amount of camels to kill him. I'm also going to make Maghreb camels to allow my camels to regenerate. He's trying to make a castle here. We just upgrade the runs and kill the views. This is probably the double G. Okay, he's trying some pikemen, losing the castle. I'm gonna steal the relic. It's only one relic, man. Advancing now. Finish it. My god, what a Brazilian, huh? Brazilian guy. He hasn't given up. Uh oh. Uh oh. Let me go back and mess some more. Uh... Obviously my monks don't kill anything. Only the enemy monks kills things. He's trying to go for pikemen. I'm going to go for the thumb ring. The upgrades on the, the Berber. I think that I can kill him because of my numbers. GG, GG. That's it. I will just keep making ready camels, camel archers, and that's it. We settle the score, you motherfucker. GG. 30 minutes in pure age, so he kind of invested into some... Uh, he tried to force a situation where I would probably try to go for his castle. I'm not dumb, I would not do it. Fuck it.